Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So the Windows 11 start menu is not without its issues because with the rollout of the OS a couple of years ago, Microsoft, as many of you will know, did not include a couple of the basic functions and small significant functions that are available over on Windows 10. As an example, being able to view and pin live tiles and a big one for me that they did not include was being able to resize the start menu, which as many of you will know, you are unable to do in Windows 11. Because as you can see, I only have a couple of pinned apps. I don't use recommended and the recommended section. So I personally would be, like to be able to um, drop the heart of the start menu and only have this section. So I can have more screen real estate and just see what I have to without all the other visual clutter. But nonetheless, that's just mentioning two examples. But there has been an issue which some users have been complaining about. And um, a user over on X recently asked Microsoft's head of Windows and Web Experiences. Basically, they said that they need to fix the issue where you have to have an extra click to get to the all apps list because as you will also know over on windows 11 you have to click all apps to get to that list where over on windows 10 all apps and the all apps list is part and parcel of the actual start menu now personally i don't have an issue with the all apps not being part of the main start menu and having to click to get to it um as mentioned my main gripe is not being able to resize the start menu and also something else is i wish microsoft as i've mentioned previously would give us an option to be able to turn off and disable this recommended section if it's not in use, as is in my case. But nonetheless, getting back to the point. So Microsoft's response to this question over on X uh, recently regarding having to have an extra click to get to the all apps list was this, and I'm quoting, they said, that is so true, annoys the hell out of me too, pushing the team, we need to make start menu great again. So by that statement over on X recently, from Microsoft's uh, head of Windows and Web Experiences, we can presume that Microsoft in up and coming updates to Windows, possibly throughout the course of this year, could include the option to be able to have the option to have the all apps as part of the main start menu and not having to have an extra click to get to that list. And something else which I think is interesting is they say, we need to make start menu great again. So this also could possibly mean that Microsoft is thinking of bringing a lot of the Windows 10 basic functions over into the Windows 11 start menu. Like as an example, I mentioned live tiles or even just the possibility to be able to resize the start menu, I think would be a nice move in the right direction. So I thought that was interesting. And as mentioned, Microsoft wants to make the start menu great again, which I think would be a good idea because the Windows 11 start menu at its base and core lacks a a good couple of the functions and functionality that are available over on Windows 10. And I'm going to keep a close eye on this one. And obviously, if I get any more info regarding any of these changes, be it the all apps list or any other uh, changes that Microsoft will bring and make to the start menu, possibly throughout the course of this year, obviously, I'll keep you guys in the loop. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.